The stick hand grenade head was made of steel sheet. The head was filled with explosive powder called TNT. The TNT is covered with a waxed paper. The bottom of the head is concave in shape. The bottom has a channel for detonator tube. The head is welded to lower cover plate. The lower cover plate has threads. The wooden handle has a metal threaded cap on the top. The threaded cap is pressed with the sealing compound to the wooden handle, and screws are inserted to hold the threaded cap in place. The wooden handle is hollow. It is made of hardwood. The bottom of the handle is covered with a metal cap. Inside the handle a burning fuse, and the cord is placed. One end of the cord is connected to a porcelain round-shaped ball, and the other end to the burning fuse. The porcelain bowl is connected to the lower metal cap. The burning fuse is made of lead, fitted with steel tube. It contains a detonator made of tetral, covered with aluminium tube and a delay powder pellet. The lead sheet contains a copper tube, which contains a friction composition inside it. A friction wire is placed inside the friction composition. The end of the burning tube is pressed to stop the free movement of the friction wire. When the lower metal cap is pulled, the porcelain bowl falls with it. The porcelain ball pulls the cord wobbed around it. Then the cord pulls the friction wire. Due to motion of the friction wire in friction composition, a spark is lighted. The spark ignites the delay powder pellet. The delay powder pellet burns exactly up to 4.5 seconds. Then the delay pellet ignites the detonator. It burns rapidly and ignites the TNT in the head. The TNT explodes. And the thin steel sheet covering TNT is shattered into many small pieces. It is more effective than normal grenades. It is also used in various alternate ways. Chinese used this for suicide bombing against Japanese tanks at the Battle of Theazone. Seven stick hand grenades are bunched together to use it for anti-tank purposes.